and one local father is sharing his story right now about how the St. Jude Children's Research Hospital changed his life. KSNT News reporter James Ryan is live in Southwest Topeka right now at our Dream House with details on why one man is so thankful for the hospital more than a decade after his time there. Brittany Lance Fi has dedicated countless hours of his life now to fundraising for pediatric cancer research, and the St. Jude Children's Research Hospital holds a special place in his heart. His son Dagan was diagnosed with AML, acute myeloid leukemia, when he was three years old. After treatment and a failed transplant here in Kansas, Dagan was referred to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, and Lance says he could immediately feel the difference. I've got this sad disappointment going on, but I'd look at these kids and the excitement and, that they have, and that just kind of turns things around for you uh, and gives you a good ability to have a strong spirit for your child. Dagan died in 2005, but more than 10 years later, Lance still fundraises for St. Jude. He says the hospital gave him an extra year with his son, and you can't put a price tag on that. And a price tag, a bill, is something that no family, Dagan's or otherwise, will ever see at the St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. And that's thanks to fundraisers like the St. Jude Dream Home and obviously people like you. Live in Southwest Topeka. James Ryan, KSNT News. And so heartwarming to hear how the hospital is helping local families in Northeast Kansas. Thank you, James, for those details. Again, construction, of course, is ongoing on Topeka's second St. Jude Dream Home, as you saw behind James there. So stay tuned right into KSNT for more information on this giveaway in the upcoming weeks.